Night of the Big E, finally here, and thousands of people gathered at the fairgrounds for Machine Gun Kelly and day one of the 17-day fair. Western Mass News reporter Lindsay Kane live for us at the Big E with all the details. Lindsay. Well, Chris and Jordan, we had uh, so much fun here tonight, and there was also a huge crowd, thousands of people coming specifically here to the Big E to see MGK. I had never been to the Big E. This is my first time too here. Opening night of the Big E is here, drawing in people who come every year and new faces as well. It's been uh, 40 years since the last time I've been here. Friday night featuring opening night headliner Machine Gun Kelly, a star who has continued to land high on the latest music charts. Yeah, I'm not kidding. I've been talking about this since I bought the tickets. But I, yeah, I'm super excited. Like, his hoodie's right here. Fans say the sold-out concert is a perfect way to kick off this year's fair. I'm really excited, uh, not just for Machine Gun Kelly, but just for the fact that it's the first concert in a long time that I've been to since COVID. I think music has a great way of bringing everybody together, and I think this is going to be an awesome opportunity. And for those coming back for their favorite treats and traditions, a Friday night couldn't have been sweeter. Big things for me are uh, maple cream cones and also uh, stuffed potatoes. I want to go to the state buildings. I haven't been there in a long time, so I'm curious on uh, seeing uh, how much they've improved. And we have just confirmed today's attendance, 80,993 people coming today for opening day. And while that is not an overall record, it is more people than opening day back in 2019. Live in West Springfield for Western Mass News 11 at 11, I'm Lindsay Kane.